I am Digital Certified Meteorologist Irene Sands and we continue to lack a rain across Central Florida. We continue to be under abnormal drought conditions and this will become even a little bit more severe during the rest of this work week as we have this high pressure system that will continue to prohibit any type of thunderstorm activity, any type of shower activity, not only across Central Florida, but across most of Florida. Now, this high pressure system is keeping all the fronts well to the north, and we also have a high pressure system in the upper levels of the atmosphere that is bringing sinking air. With the sinking air, we know that we are going to get warmer temperatures and when we move a little bit further closer to the ground well we don't have a lot of humidity in the area therefore it's going to be warm borderline hot but it's not going to feel muggy check out how the dew points have stayed across uh, central florida into the upper 50s these are comfortable dew points under our standards here in central florida and we will continue with the same trends at least for the first half of the week now the temperatures the temperatures will continue to be warm today we established two records so far in sanford and in parts of leesburg and of course we can also continue to tide or break records for the rest of the week as we continue to move into the low to mid 90s now for today we can expect the temperatures to gradually fall into the upper 60s by tuesday morning 62 degrees in the land 66 degrees i'm forecasting for tuesday morning and of course for the rest of the week we can expect the temperatures to continue to increase staying into the low 90s the highs at least through much of this work week and then approaching the mid 90s and rain free conditions for this week and possibly for the next weekend too of course you can catch the latest weather forecast on our free wftv weather app and on wftv.com